The Ivory Coast and Ghana produce about 70% of the world's chocolate. If there's any disease that is reducing the amount of cocoa that's produced, it's going to have a significant impact on the GDP of those countries. Cocoa swollen shoot virus, it spread through a mealybug vector, so an insect. It takes three years for the symptoms of infection to show. And during that time, the mealybug vectors spread the virus over quite a wide area. So being able to detect infected trees early is really important. Traditionally, uh, the virus has been detected through PCR method, which involves basically DNA extraction and analysis in the lab. Our approach uses an antibody, which will bind to the code protein of the virus, and this will enable us to actually develop a system which allows to detect very rapidly the virus in the field. Currently, the project is aiming to actually uh, develop a product, uh, a sensor, that will be actually usable. Next phase is now commercialize the product so it can be used by NGOs in West Africa, companies that actually uh, use cocoa, and to actually help farmers to prevent the virus to spread further.